Alright, heading up Death Mountain. Uh, let's use the guy to jump up to the next level. Just uh, book it to the next Goron. And then from this dude, um, you want to hop on, but don't go straight up. Go to your right. It should be east. And barely grab on, but you have to get up here. And then once you're up here, all these rocks you lift up will have 20... $20 rupees under them. So, uh, if you need some money, it's a quick, easy way. Alright, and when you see that dude up there, you're gonna see a cave to your right. Go down that. Turn around, and there should be a chest with a heart piece. And once you get that, head back down to where you left Epona. And head out towards Hyrule Field. Alright, uh, once you're out here, uh, you're going to run into the effeminate mailman. Short shorts. <laughs> Alright, after he takes off, uh, you want to blow up this rock that you see up here on the left. Once you blow it up, uh, just head up. And jump that, climb the vines. And then you want to hang a left. And when you see the boulder across the jump, Get out your trusty bomb arrows and blow it up. And then just jump across and use the vines to get back up. And then you want to jump down a couple levels and then you should see a chest. With another piece of heart. And then you want to hop back on Epona for some bug hunting. Alright, the first bug is going to be up and to your left. If you see on your map, there's like a little sliver of green. That's about where you should be. At night it's easier to see. You can see him right here, he's glowing. Alright, once you can't take care of whatever enemies attack you. The bug is a grasshopper, so it'll jump away, so walk up real slow. And then pick it up. And then you're gonna hop back on Epona and head northeast. There's not really any identifying points to find this nice one, so you wanna do it when it's getting dark. But it's in the northeast corner of this part of the map.
And there you can see it glowing. And then just walk up to it and grab it. And you want to head west to the bridge. And once you get there, uh, hop off the Pona. And if you can get off, apparently I can't. <laughs> uh, the next bug is going to be on your left, hanging out on the wall. So use your boomerang to get it. Once you snag that, uh, head across the bridge. This next bug's a little bit harder to find, but still doable. Once you cross the bridge, you're going to want to head to your left. And you see like a path kind of above. Use your boomerang. You should see a glowing bug off distance up on the wall. If you can't see it, just get closer. You can barely see it on my screen. Once you do it, lock on to it with your boomerang and bring it over to yourself. And then, um, if you need some rupees still, blow up this rock that's chilling right here. After that, you want to blow up this barricade of rocks. It's going to trigger some Twilight Monsters. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, just ride Epona over to them and start kicking some butt. And since you have to kill the last two at the same time, uh, just use the spin attack with your sword to do that. It's a little bit harder than doing killing those guys with the wolf, but yeah, it's still doable. Alright, after you slay those guys, uh, head back up the path that you just opened up, and it will take you to the next Twilight Realm. Thank you. 